Hello, is this uh, Mr. Prick? Yes. Yeah, hello. My name is uh, Nigel Mayo. I'm calling from your bank. Um, I will just ring it up to let you know that you haven't paid your monthly um, payment for your house. Sorry, what did I have? You, ha you, you haven't paid your monthly payment for your house. What do you mean by that? You know how every two weeks you pay money to, because you, you don't own your house, you pay it off to the bank? No. <laughs> You yeah. don't pay any money to a bank if you have a, a wrong number there. No, this is this this is Mr. J Prick, yeah. What number are you calling from? Um I'm calling from my, my mobile. Yeah, what uh, bank are you calling from? Uh your bank. Yeah, what is my bank? Your bank. Okay. Oh no, um ANZ Bank. I'll ring you back. No, why you hang up on me for? Sorry? Why did you hang up on me? That's very rude. Uh look, you don't even know my bank, so why should I call I'm from I'm from ANZ Bank. Yeah, I'm not with the answer. I'm sorry, you're talking to the wrong guy. This is Mr. Prick. No, I'm Prick N. Oh, no, yeah, Mr. Prick N, 125 <laughs> drive, yeah? Yeah, and I'm not with ANZ. Well, we got your name in the computer and said that you haven't paid the, uh, the monthly thing. Two, two. Yeah, then uh, check your records, I'm not with ANZ. Well, it says you are. We got your pictures here, your pictures of your wife and your then, kids and then, everything. Send me a letter and we sort it out. We I'm send you a letter? ANZ. Well, we huh? send you a letter, then you'll have to move out because it's going to be too late because you haven't paid. Hang on, do you want, hang on, can you, uh, you, you, do you want to speak to my manager because he's very, he's very furious over here. You sent me a letter and tell me what it, this is about. I don't kind of react on any calls from a mobile phone that you don't even state my bank. Yeah, well, why do we... we, we it's like a fraud to me. No, we don't, why would we waste our time sending when we can just ring you? I'll put it on to the manager, hang on. Hey, John, hey, come here, John, hey! Um, hello, sir? Yeah, um, did uh, my employee tell you what's going on? Yeah, look, you got to get the wrong guy. I'm not with ANZ. Um, uh, sir, 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 settle down, settle down. Uh, we've, got, we've got your name and um, number and address, everything in our um, system. Yes, and you, it says you haven't paid. As I said, I don't have a loan with ANZ, so it cannot possibly be right. If there is anything, please send me a letter so that I know that I'm talking to the right people. Uh, or give me a number to call back, an ANZ number, an official ANZ number, the 1300 number or something to call back. I don't take call, uh, calls over the mobile phone or something. Alright, uh, do you want the, our, our uh, business number? Yes, that's right. 1800? Uh, yeah. 2 182. 182. And if I look that number up in the internet, that is an ANZ number, is it right? Sure is. Alright, okay, I'll call you back later. Yes, sir? And um, ask for John. Thank you. Thank you, bitch. Okay. Hey, hello, is this uh, Mr. Cricket? Who's speaking, please? My name's John. Who's speaking, please? John? Wait, um, I don't... I'm, I'm calling up, I'm from the Commonwealth Bank. We're ringing up to tell you that you haven't paid your monthly payment for your house. Um, I beg your pardon? You haven't paid your monthly payment for your house. Well, your name and everything is our computer, and I got told to ring you because you haven't paid. Um, look, I'm sorry, but we don't have an account with the Commonwealth Bank. Oh, well, I think somebody said one up for you. I beg your pardon? I think somebody said one up for you. No. Who, who is the name that you want? I want Mr. Prickett, or Prickin, or Prick, whatever your name is. Um, listen, um, I don't listening. have an account with Commonwealth. And I think you've got the wrong, um, the wrong name. Okay, well, no, the wrong name, Mrs. Prickin, and from 5 Tasman Road, and then New South Wales, and I got your phone number and everything. And I got... Okay, so I think you've got the wrong number. No, I don't, and that number is right next to your address. <laughs> I'm just doing my job that, I don't know, I haven't got to hold up, because they said ring you because you haven't paid your month, your weekly payment, or every, your, your, your <coughs> fortnightly payment for your house. Um, listen, mate. We don't have an account with the Commonwealth Bank. Our house loan is not with the Commonwealth Bank. Well, so I think you've got the wrong people. Well, unless your husband has changed without you knowing, I don't know because your no, everything seems... I don't think you know what you're talking about. No, I don't think you know what you're talking about. I know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't argue with me because you're not going to win. Now, can you please pay the money by tomorrow or um, we might have to do something with your house because... If we don't get our money, my boss get very upset, okay?
Yeah, hello. Um, my name is John. I'm calling up from your bank. We're just ringing up to let you know that you haven't paid your monthly payment for your house. I have what? You haven't paid your monthly payment for your house. Yeah? Yeah, and you have to pay it because it's, it's late. What are you talking about? I haven't paid for it. You haven't, house. you haven't, no, your monthly payment for your house. You have not paid it and it's, it's overdue. I don't know what you're talking about. I own my house. <clears throat> no, you don't. You're paying it off. You're with the house, ain't that bank? Well, that's got that idea from. Who am I paying it off to? You're paying it every, um, uh, fortnightly. No, who, who to? To ANZ Bank, the money. And who am I paying it to? To ANZ Bank, obviously. No, I mean, obviously you don't know where I'm paying it to because I don't owe any money on my house. Well, you do because your name is Mrs. Cummings, yes? Well, that's too bad. I don't care what you say. Uh, I bought my house many, many years ago. I don't do, own anything on my house. Okay, well... And I never paid my money into the bank. Well, you will care when the police are at your door asking you why you haven't paid. You will care when the police are around at your house knocking on your door. Yeah, I paid. Well, let them knock at my door. And uh, I will certainly tell them that I, I've owned my house for many, many years. Okay. Why would I owe something now? Okay. Hey, John... Can you just call the police um, to 104 River Road? Because she hasn't paid. Thanks. Okay, he's calling now. Where, where is he? I'll talk to him. You're not talking to him, okay. Hang on, let, let me just hang on. Jai, Jai, Mark! Come here. Um, hello? Um, well, what's this about me not uh, paying my house? Uh, yeah, ma'am, it says on our computer. Um, to well, your... well, you better take it off your computer because I bought my house about 40 years ago. Uh, so I know nothing on my house, and I bought it from the no. housing commission. So you ring them up. Um, no, man. Uh, wait, I'm just doing my job. I'm not. I'm just. Uh, listen, listen, you want to look after your job a little bit more, or you'll lose it. You don't ring people up and say you owe me money on your house unless you've got papers and everything else to prove it. Miss, uh, I bought my house many years ago. I owe nothing on my house. Um, we are, we do have a uh, miss. Uh, we do have um papers here. The housing commission told us to ring up. And you have not paid your monthly bill for this the month? The housing commission told you I haven't paid. Uh, yes, we're just, we're, just, we're just confirming that. Because uh, on our computer right here, it says that you, you're addressing everything. Um, you have not paid for... Hold on, let's, 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 But I haven't paid for what? This month of not this fortnightly, you haven't. Fortnightly? Yes. Did the housing commission told you that? Uh, yeah, ma'am, sorry. Oh, come on. Yeah. Ring them up again, because if you don't ring them up, I'll ring them up. Um, this is ridiculous. Uh, me, uh, Three years ago, I paid my house off. Oh, I paid $145 it. a month. Oh, it's already paid for many years ago. Uh, uh, me, uh, we're very busy at the moment. Um, you would like to ring them up, and or if you can get back to us. Uh, uh, oh, I want to get back to you. Uh, yeah. What for? Well, and tell us, like, because if... If they're in the housing commission yourself and ask them. Uh, man, that's not our job. Well, it's not my job either. I pay for my house. Why don't I put up with you lot telling me I haven't paid my money for well, the house? We don't know that, man. Who do you think you are? Um, I'm John. Still in a job? You, well, you want to look after that job because you'll lose it. Uh, no. Yeah, well, you, you've got, I've got nothing to do with paying my money off. I have already done that. Oh, uh, no, well, ma'am, they're just telling us to ring up. We're not, we're just, we're not ready to do it. Who told you to ring up? The housing commissioners of, of your own of the house. Yeah, but who told you to ring up? Her, his name was Jeremy. Well, where is he from? Ma'am, we've already discussed this. Well, where is the man from? He's actually from Ingleburn. Ingleburn? And has he got a, what is he, an agent or something? Yes, or? he's the manager of, um, He's then where you, wherever you, I'm not, we don't have the information where you bought your house, but wherever he's from, he's, he's, I think he's the manager there. Well, can you give me his name? Jeremy Clark. What's his phone number? Um, hold on, let me check if I have it. My name is, um, John, I'm from your bank. We're just ringing up so you know that you haven't paid your fortnightly payment for your house. Really? Yeah. I'll tell you what, let, let me know your name and number. I'm going to ring the police because this is a... a